Welcome back. The Tulsa Press Club is giving you a chance to totally redeem yourself if you lost in a spelling bee as a child. They're hosting a special adult spelling bee competition later this month. So Becky DeVore is the executive director of the Press Club, and she's here to host our own morning show spelling bee. Good morning. Great to see you. Thank you so much for having me. So let's talk about, for people who aren't familiar, what does the Press Club do? Well, it's where the conversation begins, Leanne. Mm -hmm. um, we are a dedicated um, news organization type of we are here to um, support local journalism and um, we're open to the public as well so okay. if you'd like to come by and see some of our interesting history we'd love to have you uh, but we're really here to just support local journalism and we love it why an adult spelling bee? Who, who came up with this? What is this idea? Where did this come from? Why? Okay, that would be me. Uh, <laughs> I saw a lot of these really fun events around town that everybody's been hosting that kind of like go back to our nostalgic childhood. And I thought, well, spelling bee, press club, journalism, that kind of fits. So oh. let's have some mm. fun, right? So like those book fairs they're doing. Yeah. yeah. So you're looking for people to participate? We're looking for people to participate, people to come join us as attendees and just have a really great time. All right. What what, what give, if the people are interested and they're watching and they want to participate, we want right. to let them know Just when head, that's happening. Head on over uh, to our website. It's going to be on June the 30th. Um, it's going to be located at the Press Club, 415 South Boston. Um, we'd love for you to join us. Uh, come early if you'd like to participate in the B. Um, sign up will be that evening. Um, and tickets are available online, so we'd love to have you. We'll put all that information on our website at newson6.com. Now, Dave and I both have had a little experience in spelling. Bees. When I was in fourth grade, and the word break. the yeah, right the word that I missed was fourth because I spelled it like fourth grade. I didn't ask for a definition. I didn't ask for it in a sentence. And your word mine was isotope because I'm not a nuclear scientist, <laughs> so I didn't know. But isotope, you were probably okay? in kindergarten then. Yeah, you know. Well, I, I do. I don't want to dally anymore because we have so many words to get to. Just right, don't let's throw go. me Here isotope, let's okay, Becky? Let's, let's, let's go. Let's play some music and get this party started. Uh, I don't know about that. Okay, maybe not. All right, here we go. Okay. Okay, our first word. This is a single elimination contest. Oh. Okay, so I'm out fast. Um, I can you, tell you that right you, now, Becky. You may ask for the root, the meaning, and a sentence if you'd like. So okay. the first word, Dave, is rudimentary. Okay, rudimentary. R U D I M E N T A R Y. Good job, wow. Dave. Wow. Okay, so Dave is still in. Right? Totally okay. redeemed. Okay, all right. Okay. Quite, our right. next word, Leanne, okay. is fortuitous. Fortuitous. Yes. F O R. T U. Oh shoot! I love it when they do that at the spelling bee. <laughs> Fortune. For. Oh, F O. Is somebody playing at home? Fortuitous. F O R four two T U two it I T O U S. Correct. Oh! Wow. <laughs> Woo! Nice. Very nice. Okay. On to Alan. Your All right, word you. is acumen. Get off Ooh. Google. Acumen. Get off Google. Let's see here. <laughs> A C C U. Oh my gosh. We're being whatever. A uh, man. Acumen. Let's see here. Acumen. Uh, why would that? Can I phone a friend? Acu. A C C U. Oh, it's a oh, one C. Only one C. Oh. I didn't even let you get I'm the out. words out. Oh. I'm out. Okay, Becky thanks for is playing out. Okay. Okay. All right, so we All have right. just enough time for just a few more. Great. Okay. Dave? Uh, your next word is grandiose. Okay, grandiose. G R A N D I O S E. Grandiose. Correct. Good job, Dave. Good. All right, Good. All right. Okay. let's do it. Let's do it. Leanne, your next word is effervescent. Effervescent. Oh, Eff my Lord. E F F O R. Oh. Dang it. Okay, Dave is our winner. Okay. Effervescent. Yep, yep, yep. Let's, let's have one more for maybe like a... Like a, a, a big challenge a big word? Challenge big round. challenge word. Big okay. Challenge. One last big challenge okay. word. Okay, she's going, Let to, me she's going to the back of the page right. now. Okay, okay. Our, our big challenge word is... Let's make this one for Leanne. Leanne. Okay, okay. Okay. Icon. Use Which, it in a sentence, please. Use it in okay. a sentence. The Tulsa Press Club is proud to announce this year's media icon to Leanne Taylor. What? Congratulations, Leanne. Oh my gosh! Oh my goodness! Are you... What are you Look guys? at that! Look at that! Oh, How congratulations, nice. Leanne! Oh my word! This is incredible! Congrats. I-C-O-N. Correct. <laughs> I was going to say, if you spell it, they are rescinding the That's award That's so wrong. weird because I'm like, I thought this was a hard <laughs> word. And I was like, mm. icon, I think I know that. And then I was like, 
Congratulations. She's still Congratulations, Leah. Yes. I have to say, Jeremy was a big part of this, too. Yes. Um, he's going to chair our event this year, and we've got more details to come, but congratulations oh, to you. Oh, I'm so honored. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I really look forward to being a part of this, and definitely, if you guys are interested in spelling in the spelling bee, how fun is this? And, of course, Dave, congratulations on being the spelling bee champion. Oh, thank you very much. I should have spelled effervescent, but great, great job, and you are an icon oh, to us. Oh, you're very kind. Tulsa. Becky, thanks for joining us this morning. Thanks, Thank Becky. you so much All for right. having me.